guys, we're here in the pecan orchard cooking out. I have my RV in the back over there and my suegra does too. We have about 15 acres of pecan trees. And yeah, we're here cooking out. My husband was supposed to come home. He didn't, unfortunately. So it's just me and the kids. guys so this is my RV as soon as you walk in we have a little couch here and then straight that way we have a little TV and you can swap the TV from the room to the living room like it'll swap that way or that way and so this is our bedroom it just has two little closets and then the top so that's our bedroom and then sorry it's really dark in here I don't have light um, over here there's bottles of water there but yeah it's because last time we went camping we left our water bottles there so that's our kitchen and then right from the kitchen we have our little dining area the curtain fell off when we were moving the RV to here. So yeah, right after that, we have our little restroom. I'm using my phone as light so y'all can see a little bit better. Oh, it is hot in here, here I am. Okay, so that's our little restroom. And then we have a little pantry right here, and this is the girls' room. This used to have four bunk beds, so it was like one, two, and then on this side, three, four. But my husband took out the two bunk beds here, and we just have like a little play area. This car seat, Emma grew out of it, so I just have it there so she can sit down. And I have some extra toys here, and a little bean bag, and a, a rug so they can play. And then, of course, their little beds. And they have their own little drawer here, too. It's a used RV, but the brand new ones are super, super expensive. And so this little one is perfect for our family. It does the trick. It is super cute. And I decorated it in green. Let me go back out. Ooh. I don't know if y'all can see the pecans. They're in full bloom. They're still in their shell, they still need to fall. But there's tons of them. It's gonna be a good pecan season this year. got some goats she also has a donkey but who knows where the little donkey is he normally comes up to us and starts hollering but he's not here But yeah, we just ate some cookout and I think I'm fixing to go home already. So we'll see y'all there. Rio Grande. You can see where 
where all the the little plants for the river is. I don't know if y'all can see because the sun is hitting the camera really bad. But the Rio Grande is literally right across. Okay guys, I just saw some wild turkeys. Let me go ahead and back up my car. Don't worry, I'm in a, a dirt road, so no one really passes by through here. There's one right there, hold on. Let me go ahead and try and zoom in. Do you see it? There he is. They noticed me. They're gone. Okay guys, I am back home here in my house in my porch uh, I'm taking the dogs out to go potty but yeah I didn't plan on showing y'all my RV or going to the Nogalera today um, so yeah that was a surprise I knew we were gonna cook out today um, but I thought it was gonna be at my suegra's house but she ended up just saying you know let's go to the Nogalera we do that all the time sometimes we just like to go and be one with nature so we'll go over there and chill but anyways yeah, I think that was it for this video. Let me show you the dogs before I cut it short. The dogs want to say hi. Mary! Mo is due for a haircut and a shower. He's so fluffy. I might take him um, maybe tomorrow or the next day. Who knows? You're about to see him bald, guys, because he's going bald for sure.